How's it going everybody? Clayton here at eTrailer.com. Here at eTrailer, we install, test, and review a lot of different products to help you as a customer make a more educated decision before your purchase. Today we're going to be taking a look at, and I'll be showing you how to install, the replacement grooved clevis pin for our eTrailer and Demco tow bars. Our clevis pin is going to work with a few different tow bars. It's going to work with the Demco Excalibur, the Dominator, and the Commander. It's also going to work with the eTrailer SD and XHD tow bars. Chances are, if you need to replace one of these components, you're more than likely going to be replacing all of them. You can find your trigger handle, the spring, the pin, your retaining clip, and the latch all here at eTrailer. Before we flat tow our vehicles, it's always an important step to check our tow bar. Now in this case, we are missing our pin here. Luckily, it was that top one, so it's still going to work properly but that extra play might cause this pin to fall out. And if this bottom pin does fall out, this whole locking mechanism is actually gonna come apart. So we did get pretty lucky. Now for installing this new pin, we're just gonna take that from the bottom, line that up with the hole in our release latch, slide that through. Since we were missing our pin, we are missing our E-clip as well. That's what actually holds the pin into our tow bar. Luckily, we do sell these here at E-Trailer, so you can just pick that up when you grab your pins. We just wanna take that clip, slide it right into the groove there. We can grab some needle nose pliers or a flat blade screwdriver, really anything we have available to kind of slide that in and lock it into place. And we do wanna make sure that this lines up completely with the groove in our pin. And if our front pin was missing, we can replace that the exact same way with the same part numbers. And you can do the same thing on your other arm if it's missing those as well. And now we can safely use our tow bar again. But before we do that, we just wanna check, make sure there's not excessive play. In this case, we're good. We'll extend that, make sure it locks into place and that it releases. So we know we're good and we're ready to hit the road. That's gonna do it for our look at and our quick installation of the replacement clevis pin with the groove for our Demco and E-Trailer tow bars.